Hi there, this is Teresa. Welcome back to the channel. We are going to take a look and see the person you're thinking about. What are their true intentions when it comes to this connection? We are going to go Aries through Pisces. Feel free to check out your sun, moon, or rising placement. If you'd like your own personal reading, my email address or my website are listed down below. We are going to start with Aries first. Aries, the person you're thinking about, what are their true intentions when it comes to you? Okay, so this is somebody who is feeling like they want success. They want to figure out how to master the opportunity of, the, of opening up your heart. This is someone who may view you as very closed off, somebody who does not open up very easily, and they want the opportunity to have something really solid with you. Yeah, they want to take a look and see how they can actually get you to understand that this person is in it for the long term. They are somebody who is wanting success. They're very independent in their own right, but they're wanting independence um, on their own, but they want to be successful in this connection. This is something this person maybe has been conflicted about how to get you to open up and be more independent and more vulnerable. This is somebody who has been a little bit troubled with anxiety of figuring out how to get you to actually open up to them because they do want victory and success. This is something this person is thinking a lot about. They've been watching you and observing you to see exactly how you've been acting to see if they can help you feel more assured that they're intentions are good that they do want there to be a strong connection between the two of you and this is somebody who is investing in this connection your channeled song is imagine by john lennon taurus two okay taurus let's see what are their true intentions Healing begins, coming together, and daydreaming and decisions. So your person is trying to figure out how to heal the situation. They are making plans to come towards you. This is something that they do want. They do see that the two of you are very close to having success and victory of overcoming things from the past. This is somebody who could live at a distance from you. They may want to travel to come towards you to be closer, but they had been on the fence in the past because they weren't sure what you wanted. But now they're making the decision now that they know the truth that you do want this, even though it may be challenging and there is a lot that is preventing the two of you being in union right now. This person has fallen in love with you and they are coming towards you very slowly with the love and affection they have. Their intuition is guiding them that this is the right choice and decision. Your channeled song is Standing Next to You by Jung Kook. Gemini. Three fifteen. Okay, Gemini, what are their true intentions? Manifest, simply love, and observe. Okay, so Gemini, this person is observing who you are and they absolutely love it. This is a connection that you could have a really strong friendship with this person and they want so much more. They are trying to manifest. They've been holding back, not telling you because they don't want to come across possessive or too controlling. This is somebody who does want to make the decision to continue to move in this connection. They want to make the changes. They want to make sure that this is a situation where you don't feel hurt or disconnected from them. They are thinking long term. They see you as their wish fulfillment and their ten of pentacles. They are wanting there to be victory and success. The channeled song is Fancy Like by Walker Hayes. Cancer. Okay, Cancer, 422. What are their true intentions? The person you're thinking about, Cancer, what are their true intentions? We see release, lead, and sacral chakra. Okay, so this person is thinking that things need to change, that they need to be the one who needs to take charge in regards to 
what's happening and what needs to release in regards to the connection. They want to open up the lines of communication because they're very hopeful and optimistic. If they continue to pour into the connection, that that will lead to this great result of releasing things from the past that don't serve. They want this equal give and take. This is somebody who wants to recover from the situation and they want to be open and transparent about it. This is someone who sees you as very attractive, very successful, very much in your own right, very powerful. And that does intimidate this person a little bit. It does make them feel conflicted, but they are still gonna make the plans to try to release those thoughts and those beliefs so that they can overcome it. Your channeled song is, Is It Over Now by Taylor Swift. Leo. Okay, Leo, we've got 546 for Leo. What are their true intentions, Leo? The person you're thinking about, what are their true intentions in this connection? Shine, master, and seek. Okay, so your person is spending some time alone trying to figure out how they can embrace this connection, how they can really master the love that needs to happen within this connection. They want to be able to open up the love and they need to change things. They maybe were refusing to face, see what they needed to do in the past, but now they're imagining what they need to do. They know that they need to be able to nurture and take care of you. They want to love you with success. This is definitely somebody from the past that has great intentions. They're very comfortable with you and they love the companionship the two of you share. This is somebody who does see you as their one true love and they are coming towards you in a very passionate manner. They used to come in this more knight of wands energy in the past but they're returning more in the queen of wands and they see you as the queen of wands so they want to be your counterpart they are making the necessary changes they're no longer lying to themselves about how they feel about you your channeled song is favorite by Nicki minaj virgo All right, Virgo, 714, what are their true intentions? The person you're thinking about, what are their true intentions in this connection? Virgo, we have fine balance, spread your wings, lots of twos, and move. So your person is juggling with what this is. They maybe have been on the fence or confused about how to communicate or what to say when to say it, and that's caused a lot of confusion for you because maybe you want movement. This is somebody who is putting an end to this juggling. They're now being honest and they're being very much confident with the way they're perceiving of what they want. This is somebody who wants to take a leap of faith. They wanna to come towards you with the intention of having a new journey. They're gonna openly communicate this with you. This is somebody who feels very lucky. They feel like this is a divinely guided connection that was supposed to happen. And they want to reassure you that they are no longer confused. They're no longer sitting on the fence about what this connection is to them. The channeled song is Love You in the Dark by Adele. Libra. Libra, 8.30. Okay, Libra, what are their true intentions? Libra. What are their true intentions? Libra. Darkest fear, listen, and believe and succeed, okay? So this person has been feeling really scared that they can't give you what you truly desire. They desire you and they are listening to their intuition and they want success. This is somebody who doesn't want to miss out on the opportunity because of their own vulnerability. They are conflicted about how they could actually go forward with this connection without it failing. This is somebody who has a lot of trouble with feeling that they can be accepted for who they are. They see you as somebody who's very successful, very confident, and very assured with who you are as a person. And this is somebody who is trying to gain control over their emotions. They're trying to calm themselves down and be very resilient because look at that. They see you as divine counterparts, as the king and queen of cups. So they know that this is a situation where it doesn't need to be imbalanced anymore, that they can be very generous in giving to this connection and be very open and transparent. Your channeled song is Lose You to Love Me by Selena Gomez. 
Scorpio. Scorpio. One, zero, zero, zero. So 10, Scorpio. What are their true intentions, Scorpio? Person you're thinking about, what are their true intentions? Trust, simply love, and love. Wow, Scorpio, this person has love all over here. This is somebody who wants stability. They want to trust themselves and their intuition of what they feel. This is somebody who maybe in the past was discouraged with not trusting their intuition. They overreacted a lot. But now they're not doing that. This is somebody who maybe was inflexible with feeling overloaded with their feelings and emotions. They just want to love you. This is somebody who's seen happily ever after is with you. This is their 10 of pentacles. They are not totally confident that you feel the same way. So this is somebody who's coming towards you with this intention of hopefully you're going to feel the same way. But if not, they may have to recover from that. They're being very honest with themselves that they want their happiness and victories with you. So they're willing to nurture and take care of the connection. They want to use the laws of attraction to try to manifest this into reality. Your channeled song is It, Ma it's, it Matters to Me by Faith Hill. Sagittarius. Eleven thirty-two. Okay, Sagittarius. What are their true intentions? The person that you are thinking about. What are their true intentions in this connection? We have master, trust, and helpless and hopeless. Your person is in this energy of really closed off. They want to trust the universe will put everything in alignment the way it needs to. But they are having a little bit of indecisive energy here. Maybe because of lack of planning, lack of action. Maybe they feel like this is a commitment that's one step away. But they're not sure that you are in alignment with that. This is something that this person is hoping that you want success. But they're not really sure yet. They are coming in with a more brave persona. So they're putting on a front that they are wanting this success. And that they're optimistic that it's going to happen. And they're hopeful, but deep down, they are feeling a little bit helpless because they're afraid that the journey is going to come to an end, that you'll maybe decide that you don't want this and you're going to transition away from them. And that has left this person confused for a very long time. But their intentions is to still have this leap of faith. They are hoping you'll see that this is a great start for the two of you and that the two of you could have a lot of adventure together and have a brand new start with new journeys. Your channel song is Here and Now by Luther Vendross. Capricorn. Capricorn, 1308. Capricorn. What are their true intentions, Capricorn? What are their true intentions? The person you're thinking about, Capricorn. We have Nurture embrace well-deserved reward okay so their intentions are really good they want to nurture and take care of this connection and you capricorn this is somebody who is very invested in you they are putting in the hard work and they have all of their concentrations to develop and grow this connection they're not letting their old past or their old turmoil from hurt and disappointment hold them back this is somebody who maybe in the past had a lot of partners that were very deceptive, but they're embracing this connection with you because they see the potential in you. They see that this is a connection that could change the dynamic or outlook that the way they see love. This is somebody who does want victory and success. They want to achieve some type of advancement with you. This could be a Leo Capricorn, but this is somebody who wants to be compassionate and kind within this connection because they feel a strong bond with you. Your channeled song is Ease My Mind mind by Ben Platt. Aquarius. Fourteen thirty-two. Okay, Aquarius, what are their true intentions? The person on your mind, what are their true intentions? Control. Feeling alone 
and seeking the truth. So your person feels that there is uh, something that they need to look at from a different perspective because they are trying to unveil what the truth is that's being hidden to them. This is something that they maybe feel like they don't have any control over this choice, but they're feeling very tempted. There's a strong romantic chemistry this person feels with you. This is a twin flame soulmate union. And this is something that this person doesn't know if you feel that, but their intentions is for you to choose them because they're no longer going to lie to themselves. This is somebody that they feel this is fate and destiny that the two of you have come into union. They're being very honest with what the truth is. They're coming towards you with the intention of taking taking a leap of faith and telling you that they want a future with you. They want this to be the full package. They're not holding back anymore. They're going to let you know, look at this. You got the two of cups and the lovers and the world all in one, which is all twin flame soulmate union. Your channeled song is touch my body by Mariah Carey. Pisces. Pisces, 1605. All right, Pisces. What are their true intentions? The person on your mind, what are their true intentions in this connection? Pisces, listen. Solar plexus chakra and reach out. So your person is hoping that they're going to be able to gain the support and clarity of what they need to understanding what this connection is for their intentions. This is somebody who maybe in the past felt like they had a lot of bad karma, a lot of bad connections that were not fair, and they felt very victimized. So they're trying to listen to their intuition in guiding them and not being recognized as someone who is always selfish or someone who always wants to fight. This is somebody who wants to be loving and wants to give to a connection, but they are stuck in their head a little bit. So this is somebody who may not tell you exactly what they are thinking or feeling, but they are recognizing that there's been a lot of burdens in their past and that is baggage that they do carry with them. So this is something that their intentions is they are very restricted with how much they can give you because of their past, but they do want to open up. They do want to share some type of emotion that they're trying to gain control over what they felt from the past, and they're trying to be very steady with being able to gain some type of confidence with their success when it comes to this connection. Your channeled song is Sugar Pie Honey Bunch by The Four Tops. 